Hi everyone, just wanted to share with you guys a little album that I'm getting ready to send off. Um, first I should show you, I got my new glass mat and it's fabulous. A lot of you, thank you to everybody who recommended um, glass mats for me. I went ahead and got the Tonic Studios one. Um, so I'm excited to have it as my little Christmas present to myself. So thanks to all of you who recommended um, glass mats for me. This is the one I, I decided to go with. Uh, the mini album that I'm showing you today is for um, Yolanda, and she is uh, Yoli Bean on YouTube. She agreed to join a swap that I'm kind of in charge of, I guess. Um, it's a group called Las Scrap and Señoritas, and we are doing Latina-themed or, I guess, Latina-themed albums. <laughs> the theme for this month would be was for um, was Familia, and I created this mini album for her using the GCD Studios Autumn Afternoon paper pack. It's a really, really cool paper pack. I love it. It's a lot of flocked pages, um, a lot of papers that are textured and um, embossed. They sort of, some of them, most of them actually feel like they have, um, they're like wallpaper kind of textures. So I think they call it lacquer, flocked, and then that textured paper, so. Um, I used that paper pack, used a close to my heart um, acrylic based mini album and it's called the My Creations Acrylic Album. I also used a few, let's see, three pieces from the clearly mixed up Bow Bunny album and I might be a little partial but I think the um, Close to My Heart album is really affordable in comparison to what I remember I paid for the Bow Bunny. Um, even this clearly mixed up one that's just little smaller pieces. So I really like it. And the, the, the Close to My Heart one's the one that has all these little tabs at the end. And it comes with six pages total. But anyway, I've got some Prima Bling that I alcohol inked because it was white. I alcohol inked it with the uh, caramel alcohol ink and made them this color. I suppose I could have gone out and bought some um, Prima Bling with that color, but I figured I kind of wanted to stick with what I had. So I... Um, alcohol ink this. I did some Prima flowers, some Close to My Heart flowers, and some Petaloo um, on the front. Oh, sorry, the cover of it says uh, Familia Pasillas, and then established in 1998. Those of you who know, I know a lot of you know Yoli Bean, she is an amazing lady. Um, she has seven children, um, works outside of her home, and she is just super inspirational. She ends all of her, almost all of her videos with a little saying and she always says, um, be inspired. And that I think is super easy to do when you're watching her videos and, and that kind of thing because she's just a really, really nice lady. So um, this is the first page. These are some little felt die cuts that I got from, uh, that are from close to my heart. They're the heart felt. Oh, I never know what they're called, I always forget. Um, heartfelt wonder and heartfelt whimsy. And there's all these little die cut pieces, butterflies, trees, porcupines, mushrooms, all that kind of cute stuff. Stars, I think, in there too. So this is a tree. I covered it with some um, heart punches that I cut out from, with my, I think it's Martha Stewart heart punch. Inked some of them up. Um, this is sort of a, more of a fall themed mini album. Um, and I'm hoping to get it to her today, right before things, so that she comes out before, she'll get it right after Thanksgiving. Um, she can fill it with her Thanksgiving photos. But anyway, this on the bottom says Juntos, which is together. I added this little envelope pocket to the album. Uh, it's got a little journaling spot in the front, a tag that says Familia, and some journaling space on the back. This is the back side, lots of room for, for pictures. What I tried to do was go through and put in an, a letter for each one of her children. And this one is the J, it's her oldest daughter, I believe. Yes, daughter. And I tried to not cut these smaller than four by six, so she would just have to trim down a four by six um, photo. This is another one of those little felt die cuts. It's a little owl. And I've added some um, close to my heart pearls for the eyes. This is another, the next page, and this is um, not adhered down so she can go in and add the photo in there. This is, the next. This is one of those pages that feels like wallpaper. <laughs> and it's got a little M down here at the bottom, not adhered all the way. In this, between these two pages, I've got this little ticket piece. 
um, that I've added some uh, rub-ons to. And some of you might have known this already, but you can write on these acrylic pieces and journal on them with um, these Sharpie markers, the fine tip ones. Well, I guess the thick ones will work too, but it, you get more words in there if you use the fine tip. And I actually um, tried that on another album that I'll show you later later on, and it's a lot of, it actually is really cool to see that it's just, you know, written on there like that instead of with a little journaling spot or anything like that. So the next page, and I've added rub-ons to all of the back of these tabs pieces. I have this page um, that I created a little flap fold. This is a thicker's piece that I've sanded down because I think it was like bright pink or something. Sanded it down, painted it with the sky blue paint dauber, let it dry, sanded that, and then added the gold to kind of make it look a little, give it a little antique look. These are some Prima flowers. Um, this is a flower I think I got from OTC. It's got printed um, family printed all over it. It's a really cute flower. And I added this little pocket in here, used my Perlex powders to create this tag. Thank you, Barbara, again for my Perlex. <laughs> she um, was my secret Santa on Your Paper Pantry. And she was so sweet to get me Perlex powder. <laughs> I love it. And um, here's the little opening, like this. And this has a little ticket that's got some space for some journaling on it. And I will press that again. This is the piece from that Bow Bunny album that I added. I had to do the to do two more extra holes because the holes didn't line up with the with the um, CTMH album. But I'm gonna put some ribbon um, in here so that you kind of draw away from the extra holes. But there's a little pocket here with another flower that says family and a little ticket inside there for some quick journaling. This is some Prima Bling on the side, another little pocket with another ticket inside. Uh, some more Prima Bling. I alcohol ink this piece with um, Stream and Pearl um, Mixative. This is the next page. I got a little butterfly on the tab on this one. This pocket was kind of fun because I, I know she probably have a ton of photos so I wanted to do as many photo options as I could. So she's got plenty of space on here to do um, photos and journaling on them. This ticket piece here is a, just a quick little piece that I added. It uh, has a, a rose charm on it. And then it says, Donde está tu tesoro, ahí también está tu corazón. Which means um, where your treasure, yeah, where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. And then the little journaling spot. This is the last photo mat here. And I've added an extra little folder flap so that she could um, add in just a couple more photos if she wanted to. And these are all, again, another um, rub-on. And then the back, and this is one of those um, embossed or lacquered pages. Super cool. So sorry about the glare, guys, but with an acrylic album, it's kind of hard, I think. Um, I wanted to just thank Yoli for participating in the in the La Scrap and Senorita Swap. We will be doing another one uh, starting probably right after Thanksgiving. I want to give everybody a chance. I know because Christmas is going to be looming and all that kind of stuff, but um, wanted to see if we could get sign-ups for the January um, mini album swap. It'll be due January 30th and the theme will be Amor and that way you will get it to, you will get it before Valentine's Day. So if the, any of you want to participate, um, I don't have a blog for Las Crapas Señoritas yet, but um, you just go to my blog and, and sign up again under um, the January swap, which will be uh, themed Amor. So there we go. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Yoli, I hope you like it. And um, I saw a sneak peek of the one you made for me, so I'm excited. Uh, thanks so much, guys, for watching. Bye.